All right, so Kamala Harris's idea is what? The profit margins have gone way up. They don't have to go way up. So this problem has largely been left to the states for 100 years. It's called price gouging. That is, if I can control a price without selling less, if I can raise the price without selling less, that's called price gouging. That belongs in state law, historically. Kamala Harris is the only candidate who has said that with so much concentration in the grocery market, we have got to have a national price gouging law so the Justice Department can look at it. Because if it's inflation they can't avoid, that's fine. We don't want to put them out of business. But if they're trying to put you out of business, that's not fine. And that's just one example. That's called socialism, government control of pricing over businesses. Now, still, most people don't know that. That is a big deal, that she is the only candidate with any plan that will actually give us a practical way to deal with this grocery problem without sticking it to honest people doing their best to run a grocery store and selling you food at reasonable prices. It's the only thing. And we should be jumping up and down. But why aren't we jumping up and down? If you vote for Camilla Harris, you will be paying higher prices for eggs. You'll be getting a little bit of money from the government and you will be starving. It's called socialism, people. Please, Democrats, please recognize that you are being played. Thank you for watching.